Hey there, 2Bs. Welcome back to 2230. We're super excited to dive into this topic with you. If you're enjoying this content and want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an upload. We love creating content for you and appreciate your support. Let's get started. It's important to remember that sexually deviant behavior is a serious issue that affects not just the perpetrator, but also those around them. The case of Kavel Chua Kuchin, who was recently sentenced to three weeks in jail for committing obscene acts in public, is a reminder of this. While it's unclear what motivated Chua to engage in such behavior, it's clear that he needs help and support to address his issues. It's also important to note that Chua's actions were not victimless. By masturbating in public, he created an uncomfortable and potentially traumatic situation for those around him, particularly the young girls practicing ballet in the nearby studio. Also, the young girl whom he made eye contact with briefly could have left an emotional scar on her. It's crucial that we take the safety and well-being of all members of our community seriously and work to prevent such incidents from happening in the future. In cases like this, it's also important to consider the broader social and cultural factors that may contribute to such behavior. While Chua's intellectual disability may have played a role, it's also possible that societal pressures and expectations around relationships and sexuality may have contributed to his frustration and feelings of isolation. By addressing these underlying issues, we can work towards creating a more supportive and understanding society that promotes healthy relationships and sexual behavior. Thanks for tuning in to this response video. If you want to stay up to date on the latest reactions and responses, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And as always, I love reading your comments and feedback. Once again, thank you for viewing and I hope to see you on the next video.